Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Chess and today I will be showing you how I created this look with the split liner by Glisten Cosmetics in Tortoise Shell. And yeah, if you want to see how I created this, then please keep on watching. First, let me tell you what's already on my face. I put this Profusion Matte Lip Cream on my lips in Matte Cocoa and on the eyes I already have this shade from the Carly Bible Deluxe Palette BH Cosmetics. Now it's time for the split liner. This is in Tortoise Shell as I said and yeah, it's a liner with two colors so we need to activate it with water and then we're gonna choose a brush. We can choose two types of brushes but I'm going for the short one right above my lash line because I just feel like this works easier um, right above the lash line. <laughs> so yeah, this works very well and you can see it's very opaque and I love the warm brown color of it. I'm also doing the same on the other side and decided to connect it to my inner corner. I'll get a little bit more of a cat eye effect. Then I'm wetting it again because I'm going in with the more orangey color on a long brush because this is ideal for it apparently and it went very smoothly. Luckily on both sides, but I needed to correct it a little bit, wanted to thicken it up. So that's what I'm doing here and it actually goes surprisingly well with a longer brush like this. This is by the way actually a nail art brush I got from A Wish, so yeah, it works very well. And then with a brush with nothing on it, only a little bit of water, I'm going to clean up a few of the mistakes I made because guys, I'm not a pro at this. And then I'm going in with a similar brush and the first one I use with the orangey shade on again. And just like doing some finishing touches, if you will. So this is a look without any mascara or anything. Well, let's add some mascara. So this is the Glam and Doll Mascara by Catrice. This is already a look that is very fierce to wear in real life without needing to add any false lashes. Oh, and I changed up the background. I also added a lip gloss from Dewy Full Lips by Catrice and adding these lash like boss lashes from Essence. Then I'm going in with the more brownie shade again, well the warm brown shade, and I'm just perfecting it a little bit because the lashes did cover up some of the work that I did. So that's what I'm doing here, just making it a bit more prominent. Going back in with the more orangey shade as well, and I'm creating a more ombre effect right above the lash line. I think that looks really cool. Then with my NYX Epic Ink Liner, I'm going to clean up any mistakes that I made with the liner on the lashes, and with the long lasting eye pencil in Black Fever by S. Since I'm just meshing my lashes together with my upper waterline and also creating some depth on the sides. And there you have it. This is the finished look with the Tortoise Shell Split Liner. I already have multiple liners like this that are water activated from Glisten Cosmetics and I'm really happy with the formula. So I hope this little tutorial helped someone out and I also have a code to share with you for 10% off that is CFMH10. So yeah, thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.